we were always raised that a woman must take a back seat. We must, um, we have to suppress our views, we have to suppress our opinions, and that I want to change. I know that we, we've made a lot of progress as our country since the abolishment of apartheid in 1994. But I have to be honest, we still have a long way to go as women as to voice out how, how, how we feel, how we view, what our opinions are. And that, to me, is more important than anything. I don't want to be an advocate for other women. I think it's important that we pull each other up. Yeah, if, um, well, I believe that uh, gender equity is not just supposed to stop at me. I must pull other women. It's important that we all move together. So as women out there, we have to start supporting each other. We still have a long way to go as, as women in politics and also in leadership. And very, very importantly is that we who are politicians at this moment need to hand over the baton very um, slowly but also very, um, I don't know, in, in a very good way right now so that we create a next level of young women in leadership. Because what we don't want is that when we have to put down the baton and we are asked where are these women, we cannot answer them because we ourselves did not groom or we did not even um, create a next la layer of leadership. So I think it's time that we um, disposed of... Um, what other women say that we don't pull each other up. It's important that we pull each other up. Yeah, as much as we need the men to support us. But uh, where I'm going, when I go back to my country, the first thing that I'm going to do is to make sure that I pull a lot of women to come and be part of decision-making um, uh, positions. You find that in, in council, you get those that are seasoned leaders, you get councillors that are quite new. But they cannot speak to each other. They do not speak the same language. So we need to just be in one house as women in leadership and speak issues that relate to women and see how we can pave a way. Because I feel in that way we can get a better solution, not just to sit as, as female councillors of one political party in our different corners. Let us come together as women from the same council and, 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 and just remove the, 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 the bars and those walls that are in front of us and pave a way for our community and for our generations to come. As women, when we get into politics, we need to have um, active positions and we need to make ourselves active. Um, I've learned something new. Um, sometimes you get into politics and you, you don't realize that you're actually doing kitchen politics where you're just sitting there and you're being sent South Asia, the women, not to come and do kitchen politics. You've got to take um, a, a big step and speak. Be part of the change.